looking at this uh, city engine, uh, standalone desktop 3D modeling application. It allows you to model 3D, 3D cities way faster than with conventional tools like Maya, SketchUp or 3ds Max. So what you normally do is you start with the terrain. You see this here can be imported uh, from arbitrary sources. Then uh, we see here a street network, so a line of streets that can be drawn, sketched within City Engine or can be ex imported from external data like GIS data or CAD data. Um, then City Engine creates what we call shapes of the street network. So you see we, we have here parcels, we have um, street shapes, crossing shapes, sidewalk shapes and so on. And all this is uh, very flexible, so you can move streets around here and you see that the parceling and the footprints update. As a last step, City Engine then creates the building for you. And again, on every footprint, on every street shape, it generates a street. And this is uh, generated in real time. So if I use a street, freehand street creation tool, I can create a new block here and it will generate these buildings on real time. I can also go in and fine tune individual buildings. For example, change the le level of detail to a higher level of detail. So you can see this here that we now have uh, extruded windows. I can change the height of the building to something bigger and everything is generated on the fly. So what you're looking at is uh, one of our building template or rule sets which is a Paris style rule, European city. But you can also apply other uh, rule sets on this. So I can take a more uh, international city rule here, apply this. I will get a different style of buildings generated on these parts. So for example here, if I want to change this to high-rise buildings, I can do so. Uh, here I can make office buildings and change the height factor to create a very high building here. So as you can see it's very easy to create or modify a city layout. Everything is updated in real time and once I'm happy with my design I take this out to our various export formats. So, for example, we want to take it out to an offline render, to a game engine, or for further modeling uh, on Maya, you export it to FBX, OBJ, Colada, and so on. Another feature that we have is, is the City Engine web scene export, which is a one-click export to a WebGL format that then runs in your browser. So this is another scene that we exported from City Engine, and. Uh, this is like a campus, campus scene here, and this is really modeled in City Engine. One click export, and it runs in your browser, and that viewer comes for free along with City Engine too.